welcome to uh, this episode of The Wedding Vibe. I am Victoria. And I'm Shelley. We're actually going to talk about the wedding aisle. Dun, dun, dun. Okay. So the thing that I see repeatedly uh, down the aisle is uh, the not being able to get down the aisle. So you know, you've got your beautiful lanterns with candles, you know, and then you've got a humongous dress and your dad and you get to the top of the aisle and your frock won't fit. Do not set yourselves on fire, baby. <laughs> we not like just yet, anyway. fire! <laughs> no, but do not set, I've set myself on fire at a wedding for you. Double check on the actual width of the aisle and make sure that what you actually want to happen can actually happen. So if you're having a big dress, measure the width of your dress. I am not kidding. Uh, and then add on the width of your palm. <laughs> <laughs> make sure there's plenty of room, plenty yeah. of room. You don't want to kind of leave one behind. Yeah. Um, so yeah. yeah. We want it to be smooth running, smooth running down the aisle so to see your betrayals. Yeah. So we know how wide we have and we can do some things to decorate the aisle. So what we're looking yes. at. So uh, this year we're going to have all kinds of really cool stuff, right? So no longer do we just have to have the lanterns. Okay, okay. <laughs> so the big thing this year, a uh, hot on the trends from America, across the pond, uh, is, believe it or not, you 80s vibers, uh, is the pampas grass. Ba, ba, ba. Now, if you're anything like me, I had to Google what pampas grass actually is. Here you go, this picture of pampas grass. How does that look? Oh, that's cool, man. That oh, was cool. Oh, it does look cool. Oh, cool. Of course, uh, if you're of a certain age, uh, you'll remember those uh, pampas grass things in your parents' garden. And then you'll also <laughs> remember the connotations of our wife soccer. We're not going to go there. Yeah. We'll start <laughs> off with, let's just leave that there. But yeah, but it's that fluffy, again, we're coming back to our au natural, organic, you know, holistic type of stuff. It's all in love, man. Yeah. All fluff. So what if, you know, you don't have space to have pampas grass down the aisle, what can we have? If it's a bit tight down the aisle, or if you're a bit strapped for cash and you can't afford the big beautiful pampas grass and all that kind of thing, uh, you could go for something really, really simple. You're ready for this? This is going to blow your mind, okay? Lavender. Lavender would smell incredible. You imagine you walk down the aisle, you're treading on your lavender petals or whatever they're called, seeds. Seeds? The petals? Oh, no. <laughs> uh, but as you, you know, you get your flower girl to scatter your pet petals as you, before you head down the aisle, and then you walk over them and they release the scent, and whoa, it already smells amazing. If you haven't got the lavender, you can do the petals, right? I think petals are really quite cute and actually gives a flower girl something to do on the day and stop them from picking their hair, picking their nose, picking their nose. I give them something to hold and, you know, a little job to do. Yeah, we like, yeah. That means nothing cute then, flower girl, right? Yeah, yeah. exactly. All eyes on the <laughs> flower girl picking her nose. I've uh, thought of uh, something else that you could have down the aisle. And okay, yeah. here we go. Wow, he got feathers. Which would tie in pretty beautifully with the Pantone theme this year. Yeah. Imagine those in like, you know, little tall vases or something. Yeah. And they could also be incorporated within your <laughs> bridegroom's buttonholes. Oh, or yeah. cool. If you really were thinking of people fishing your theme, you could have that incorporated in your floral arrangements or yeah. like table decorations or. I love it. I love a peacock feather. Yeah, they're amazing. Also, you can use them as tickling sticks. <laughs> yeah, okay, we can use them as tickling sticks. Right. <laughs> okay. So, one of the things uh, that I spoke to Forrest about recently, and she was talking about uh, cotton plants. Okay. Oh I've my goodness, that's so cute. They yeah. Are yeah, yeah, yeah. Gorgeous. Yeah. So, little cotton plants in like uh, a demijohn with like um, twinkly lights in the bottom. Oh. How is that being? Oh, really really romantic, really soft. Uh, we have a picture actually uh, from our wedding uh, recently and don't they look great? They look amazing, right? They look beautiful. Yeah, uh, do that. Excellent man. idea. Yeah. Also, you can make wine afterwards in the demi job, right? Yes. Yes, yes, yes. Wine yes, yes. is yes. good. <laughs> okay, what else can we do? Candles. 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 Um, can I just come back? 
back to the do not burn yourself. Yeah, so big dress can kind of give a little bit of a fire hazard there. Also oh. check with the venue as well, just in case they good advice. will allow that. But we can do the battery operated candle. You get some really sophisticated yeah. candles these days that do the flickering thing. But the battery room, right? Mm. It'll last all day. Yeah, you can reuse them, give them as flavours to your guests maybe. Um, and put them on your top table. Money top table. Yay! Yeah. They don't kind of look as um, as naff as they used to. Um, yeah, they cool, do look really they? nice, yeah, yeah. definitely. Nice. Or if you wanted, you could actually have um, the mason jars with real candles in as well, and that would sort of um, give a little bit more of a covering to yeah. the candles. So, you know, yeah, yeah, save the people. Be safe. Be safe. Uh, so, the final thing that we're going to end with today is the carpet runner. What say you, Vix? I say nay. I say nay. No carpet runner. Come on. This is not the 80s. We no. don't need that carpet. We have some trips up there, or it's a <laughs> bit of a muddy day outside, and there's footprints on there. And nah. I just think it's something else to think about and worry about. Yeah, no I'm all about keeping it on the down low this year oh, with oh. organic and organic. seeing that floor covering as yeah. you're walking down the aisle, whether that's. Um, Wood or what have they got here at Wild Bear? Uh, polished concrete. Polished concrete, which will look absolutely stunning. Yeah, amazing. So yeah, forget the, forget the carpet. Uh, this is not your mum's wedding. This is your <laughs> wedding, <laughs> and it's going to be amazing. Anyway, um, let us know what you think down there in those comments. Yeah. Uh, let us know what, if you're having some crazy, crazy thing down your aisle that we don't know about. We need to know about that stuff. Okay. We'd be the wedding band. Bye! Bye!